Please rise for a moment of silence to be followed by the pledge. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. Good morning, BHS. I'm Trace Mandeville. And I'm Eden Savoy. And, and welcome, welcome to Bash TV. TV. Today is Monday, September 27th, making today the official 25th day of school and day one on the cycle. The lunch menu for today will be chicken nuggets, sliced bread, green beans, and milk. The breakfast menu for tomorrow will be apple roll, peaches, assorted juice, and milk. We will be closed Thursday, September 30th, and Friday, October 1st for the fair. PSAT testing will be available to juniors and sophomores. Test fees are $10 for juniors and $18 for sophomores. The tests will be given at the high school on Wednesday, October 13th from periods 1 through 4. The PSAT is a great primer for the SAT, and scores are used to identify national merit scholars and award merit scholarships. Sign up with Mrs. Curry in the guidance office by Wednesday, October 6th. SAT testing dates are scheduled for November 6th with the registration deadline of October 8th, December 4th with the registration deadline of November 4th, March 12th with the registration deadline of February 11th, and June 4th with the registration deadline of May 5th. Seniors and juniors, it's time to start looking into colleges and filling out applications. A college admissions representative from several colleges will be available for appointments. A representative from Wilkes will be here October 6th at 12 o'clock. A representative from Bucknell University will be here on Thursday, October 14th at 9 a.m. A representative from King's College will be here October 20th at 8.30. Luzerne County Community College will be here on Thursday, October 28th at 10 a.m. Interested students should sign up in the guidance office. Well, that's it for the main desk. Now let's hear from Brendan with sports. Thanks, Trace and Eden. I'm Brendan. Let's take a look at the sports scores from Thursday and the sports for tonight. On Thursday in girls volleyball, Berwick had a great performance in a 25-16, 25-11, and 25-21 win over Pittston. C.C. Eisenberg had five aces, five digs, seven service points, and 21 kills. Morgan Neville produced four aces, four kills, nine digs, 14 service points, and 27 assists. Cassidy Evans finished with one ace, two kills, three digs, and seven service points. Kaylee Hacker had one block and five kills. For tonight's sports, JV football is away with Williamsport at 5 p.m. Girls Varsity Soccer is home with Wyoming Area at 6.30 p.m. Varsity Tennis is home with Wyoming Area at 4 p.m. Varsity Volleyball is home with Holy Redeemer at 5.30 p.m. Now over to Morgan with FYI to see what's happening around BHS. Thanks, Brendan. I'm Morgan, and welcome to FYI. Let's check out what's going on at BHS. The new books are here and ready to be checked out. Please stop by the library to check out the selection. There will be a yearbook meeting on Tuesday, September 28th, after school in room 55. There will be debate club meeting to today at 2.40 p.m. in Mr. Gonham's room, room number 9. All interested students are welcome to join. The Teen Center has several announcements. September is National Suicide Prevention Month. The Teen Center is taking the following action steps. They are offering a three-part series with the hashtag BeTheOne2, which will include the following. Monday at 4.30 p.m., they are making stress balls with water beads that helps alleviate stress. Tuesday at 4.30 p.m. is yin-yang yoga, which includes techniques to clear the mind of negative thoughts, emotions, or sensations. Wednesday at 4.30 p.m. is creating a safety plan. Well, that's it for today's episode. To conclude, we'll leave you with the birthdays for today. Happy birthday to Camden Mosteller. 